Warning. This video is not for minors. The characters used in this e-federation have all given their consent. This material is make-believe and has been rated M for mature. If video game violence offends you, please click out of this video now. 18 and older only. Proceed with caution. Thank you. Coming to you live from Brooklyn, New York. This is YTWE 18 Plus World Wide Wednesday. And tonight, we got David Rivera going up against Dark God in a rematch from last week. But right now, we're going to hear from David Rivera. So lately, I've been getting a lot of support from my TWE 18 Plus fans. And as well, with the respect of the locker room so far as of right now. I may not have the best track record as of right now, but I am basically 2-2 two two with being able to go over my match with Dark God and everything, and I was very successful. So hopefully things will stay on the right track and be able to move on up right here in the YTWE 18 Plus universe. So with that being said, I'm looking to be able to go beyond my means and be able to go up against the very best. And it doesn't matter who it is right now, it could be anybody and I'll be able to pay my dues within due time. Since I'm still new here, I know I get that, but things will get better, guaranteed, and that is a damn fact. As always, watch me move. David Rivera versus Dark God. This is match number five for David Rivera. He has lost two and won two. Can he win again, again tonight here, Mr. D? Well, we were about to see, we got some nice technical wrestling going on here from Dark God. And this is Dark God just showing David Rivera that he can do more than just an eye rake. <laughs> oh yes, absolutely. I'm surprised it didn't pull David Rivera's eyes out in their last match. But he's here again tonight competing, trying to get that other victory. Well, I think Dark God... Figured it was going to be an easy win over David last week, uh, last Wednesday, whenever it was. Uh, but it wasn't easy. David actually beat him in, what, four or five minutes? Yes, yes, it was a very quick match. But, you know, it got the job done and that's all that matters. Uh, David got Dark God on the ropes, sending him off the far side. Boom, nice. Nicely done there. You, you seem a bit out of sorts, Mr. D. Is everything all right? Ah, I was out partying last night, Joe. And you know Mr. D likes to party hard. <laughs> Plenty of Jack Daniels. You know the way it is. And I am as hungover as you fucking like right now. But I'm here. I'm at work and I'm doing what I'm supposed to be doing. <laughs> But you just have to bear with me. Alright, we'll do, Mr. D. We've got a match to do, we've got a match to call. And David Rivera had him up. Oh, and a nice DDT there from Dark God. Nice counter there from Dark God. He's getting him back up. It turns him around. Oh! Nice elbow. Spinning elbow drop to the chest. Driving him down with that diving reverse DDT style move. Very, very unique, very different move there from Dark God. Spins him around again. And Dark God, it looks like he's gone for it again. He hits it again. It's twice now. Yeah, that is, twice. Drive, driving that elbow down into the sternum of David. Really knocking the wind out of him. And Dark God, he's just been relentless right now. Oh, nice. Not Let letting go. David up. What I've got to say though, Joe, is... Dark God right now, I, I haven't seen him cheat in this match yet. Well, <laughs> he tried cheating in their last match and it didn't work out. So maybe he's changing his strategy in this one. He could be, and I think the thing about Dark God, what people don't realise. Soul Cracker! Soul Cracker! Interrupted myself, but there you go. Big fucking move. He's down. One, two. 
Oh man. Not even close to a three count. That was barely a two count. But what I was gonna say, Dark God, he's a veteran of the e -feds. He's actually been around for a long, long time and he's wrestled a lot of people. So you know, people like myself look at Dark God and we don't see much in him as a competitor, but the guy has got it in him. You know, the guy's done a lot. He's grabbing the ropes. You know, that soul cracker didn't seem to do much to David Rivera. I mean, Dark God hit that move, and ever since then, David Rivera has took control of this match. And he's on the top rope, Mr. D. On big, a big splash. massive splash. Very nice. Doesn't go for the cover. Could that be a mistake? It could be. Here's that pendulum. DDT driving the forehead into the canvas. One, two. Oh man, come on. Come on, David. You can do this. Dark God kicking out. That pendulum DDT, Joe, has only been successful for him once, but he keeps going back to it. Yeah, I'm, I mean, if he hits it again, that could be it, but we'll see what happens. He's grabbing it out. We saw this at the end of the last match. Turning him over. It's got to be it. One, two, three. Oh, Dark God's up. Dark God kicking out. Well, that's that's surprised me quite a, a bit. To be fair, I thought that was I thought that was all she wrote right then and there. So did I. He put Dark God away in the last match. That very same move. That implant buster. Whatever you want to call it. David Rivera now though. Oh look at that! A little spinning elbow of his own. But David right now, I don't know if he oh, doesn't know what to do nice with himself. Elbow drop from the top right Love. Lovely elbow drop. But David has hit all of his big moves on Dark God and Dark God coming at him. I mean look at that! Knocking Dark God to the outside, it is clear to me, Joe, that David Rivera does not know what to do with himself right now. Well, you know, we don't really see David Rivera go to the outside that much. So maybe, oh well, he's, he's throwing him back in, but we don't see David Rivera on the outside that often. Nice leg drop on the apron. Maybe he's getting but a yeah, bit desperate. Yeah, you're right. You know. He's hit both, he is. He's hit like both of these said. big moves and they didn't work, so... Exactly. And that's... that's David Rivera has got a hit. Oh, I think he went for it. I think he went for that pendulum DDT again. But countered by Dark God. And Soulcracker! There's that Soulcracker again. Could this be the one? One. Two. Oh, David's up. Again, a quick kick out David's from David Rivera. Come on, David. You can do this, man. You can do this. He's fighting back. There it is. There it is. Pinch, but he's not. He's out himself. He's got to move. He's got to move. Come on, David. There it is. One. Two. Oh. Oh man, that was close. Unbelievable. He needs to hit his Dark finish. Dark God up. David needs to hit his finish to get the victory here. That's what it's going to take. Nice. Float over suplex there from Dark God. And Dark God is setting David up here, waiting for him to get up. Is he going to hit his finish? He's got him up. Choke. Two handed choke slam! <laughs> Nicely done. Nice move there from Dark God. And that could be all she wrote. And David Rivera. One, two, three. Oh, oh no, man. it wasn't three. Oh, my days. <laughs> Come on, David. Man, David Rivera has got some fight in him. Dark God giving David everything he's got. And here we go. Punches to the back of the head. 
slamming that face in the mat a little bit dirty now from Dark God. He's, you know, he's tried to be clean through this match, tried to out wrestle him, but it's just not happening. Absolutely. And I've got to say, every time I see David Rivera in a match, he impresses me a little bit more each and every single time. He gives us that little bit more each and every time, though, Joe. And that would be why. Into the corner. David Rivera it. fighting out. And there it is. He's going for it again. This has to be it. Dropping him. Face first. Well done, Dave. <coughs> it was a rope break. He was too close to the ropes. No way. Oh, I can't believe Rookie it. mistake, David. I can't believe this. Rookie mistake. Absolutely. Oh, nice. Dark got in with that neck breaker. Yes, absolutely. This... I can't call who's going to win this one. This this match could... There's a Soul, soul cracker, cracker again. The Soul Cracker again. And he's going to cover. The cover. One. Two. Three. And there it is. Fucking hell. Oh, my day. What a match. Yes. What a match, Joe. Very good match, Mr. D. And Dark God proving why he is a veteran. Man, Dark God really gave us something different tonight but David Rivera a valiant effort but man he just was not prepared for what Dark God had for him tonight no and that's why Dark God is a veteran that's why he has been around so long because of things like that his last match he was dirty he was cheating but this one he was wrestling you know he was working the match and he, and he got the victory that's the thing about Dark God, as much of a silly bastard as he can be at times, when he is about business, he is all about business and he gets the job done. Absolutely, absolutely, and, that, and he just proved it in, in this match tonight. Well, we're looking for more out of David Rivera. David just cannot seem to get the momentum going he's one two lost three now so david man recently boston fan left a message saying he was going to leave a pipe bomb what he left was actually a water balloon filled with diarrhea but i called him in we had a chat we've had an understanding he's apologized in person and he's apologized publicly Go and check out Boston Fan's new video where he addresses his recent promo. Boston Fan, we're all good, man, and I wish you the best of luck in your match with Robert Rage. Hey YTWE 18 plus, Dark God here. Just want to address a couple items. First item, I wanted to say good match, David Rivera. You're uh, soft spoken, but you keep up a good fight. We're one on one here. You beat me in the one match, I beat you in one. Right now, we're toe to toe, and I appreciate that. You keep up the good work and don't let anybody, not even me, tell you what to do. My second item, what's invisible and smells like DeVito's dick? That would be Boston fans' breath. You see, funny thing, he had the nerve to call somebody I don't like, but he was calling Brick Wigger a dick sucker. Sucking DeVito's dick. Okay, newsflash. He sucks everyone's dick, Boston fans. He doesn't care, but that's his specialty. Makes them happy. But the thing is, you've been sucking his dick for as long as I can remember. Not that long ago, you were going on about, oh, Robert Rage making light of DeVito's name and la 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 la. And 
Reese, and even recently, you you took a stand, only to just in your last video that I saw, sucking his dick again. And every time you say at the end of the day, which you said like five times, by the way, I've heard of catchphrases, but catch a clue, catch a new phrase. But at the end of the day, all I'm hearing is at the end of the dick, which is you with your dick sucking. Boston fan. Come on now. Watch what you say. Because one thing Dark God catches is hypocrisy. Don't call someone a dick sucker of someone specifically if you're going to suck the same dick. So, at the end of the day, Dark God says fa <laughs> fa Well, very interesting comments there from Dark God, but let me put this one to rest. Nobody is sucking my dick to get what they get here in YTWE. This is not the WWE, and I am not Vince McMahon.